we are all taking action shaping our future and optimizing our performance for both our work and life today we are diving into jason slick and tom barton's game changing ideas from organize tomorrow today this book is all about training your mind to get important things done without getting bogged down into the busy work of daily life so let's kick things off with the first principles first one is organize tomorrow today Here is a big deal. Being productive isn't about doing more. It's about doing what matters most. Seen and Bato suggest a simple habit called OTT plan. Each day, make a quick list of three tasks for tomorrow with one absolute must. The idea is to prepare yourself in advance so you can hit ground running. Find that sweet spot between lunch and 3 p.m. to jot down your priorities. It's only take five minutes, but it will set you up to accomplish what really counts second one choose wisely this plan is backed by research it taps into miller's law which says we can only juggle so much at our brains once about three things effectively and here is a twist that one must task it's not just to do it's a fuel for your mind the effect shows that our mind fixate on unfinished businesses so planning that one essential task gets your brain working on it even in your sleep focus on one thing build momentum and let it to a power you through the day and third one maximize your time forget basic time management top performers do something bigger they maximize time by training distraction trimming distractions and focusing on impact and the authors call it attacking the open space those small gaps in your day don't let them cluttered with social media or random task instead prioritize these critical tasks first break down big projects into manageable steps and move to the next when time is up it's about doing the most important thing even with the short burst of time number 4 win your fight through Forming new habits isn't one-time effort. It's about daily battle. The authors break down the process into three phases: the honeymoon, the fight through, and finally the second nature. And here is a key: when you get hit the fight through phase, the temptation to skip a day, pause and ask, "How will I feel if I push through?" Visualize the rewards and make winning these battles part of your daily daily. And small wins compound into big and lasting habits. Number five: evaluate. correctly we will all tend to dwell on negative and it's part of our wiring but that minds it can lead to downward spiral instead evaluate honestly start a daily success log and give yourself credit for what went well and not just what didn't focus on the process like basketball legend john wooden did when you evaluate yourself on effort not perfection you build confidence and that's where real growth happens Number six, learn to talk yourself. Self-talk can make or break your mindset. Authors emphasizes removing negative self-talk with two-minute mental workout. It's simple. Center your breath, repeat a positive mantra, and visualize success. And center again. Done regularly, this workout strengthens your self-image, turning your mind into an ally. Ally. Number seven. communicate with others great communication is a superpower it's about being clear confident and concise prepare your message slow down and practice the success triangle suggests rephrasing the three times over three days before your big conversation by cutting the fluff pausing for impact and rephrasing you will get your points across and be remembered number 8 be abnormal if you want to be great normal cu- won't cut it authors argue that all high achievers have a bit of abnormality this means no excuses focusing on what's in your control and prioritizing solutions over problems progress don't come from perfection it about small steady improvements that add up over time and that's a wrap of organize tomorrow today this step can make you set up for the real lasting success but it also start with just few minutes of each day before you close out take 3 minutes to jot down tomorrow's top 3 task pick one must set your focus and repeat this and watch your productivity